Sadie, you be a good girl. You got my baby chickies all out in the chicken tractor. Hatched all these here a few months ago. Well, no, I'd say two months ago. Trying to keep them in the tractor. Oh, Sadie's chasing them. Sadie, hey, hey, Sadie, girl. You leave them alone. You can't have them. No. Oh, they're so beautiful. That black one's a cross between Americana uh, Longhorn Rooster and a black sex link. Brown ones are the same rooster, but with uh, the ice of browns. And it, weirdly, these white ones, I'm not sure which ones were their mothers. I'm assuming the browns, because there's hardly any black on them. So that was kind of, that one there is, well, she got a little bit of black on her tail. So that might have been from a black, but it's kind of odd that she's all white. Ooh, little competition. Little competition, girls. So these girls will be laying here in another 60 days, probably. Or less. Then I'll move them to the big coop. Because they're going to get their own coop. Sadie. At least you're keeping them exercised. But the gray ones are just gorgeous. Sadie. Hey, girl. Sadie. Sadie. No, you stop. Not sure what she would do with them. She won't chase the big chickens. Because the roosters will get out and then uh, the roosters will attack back at Sadie. So she leaves the big ones alone. So, Oh, Sadie. Sadie. You be a good girl. Just going to knock my phone right out of my hand. Are you done, Sadie? You're going to get all out of breath, girl. This chicken tractor is like two years old and still using it. I've had... Oh, what did we have going around this freaking thing? Uh, I'm trying to get the big chickens. I think it was a, a fisher cat. It was running circles around this thing and couldn't get in it. Did a really good job building this. You go to tractor supply, you'll spend $500 on something that's a third of this size. We built this for free. Just scrap materials that I got from uh, jobs or buddies that, you know, hey, I need this gone, so come get it. And that's what homesteading's all about. Making good contacts, good friends. When they got crap that they just don't like, don't they need to get rid of, they don't want to pay to get rid of, Hook up with those people because they can give this stuff to you. Even this mesh screen, this got a contractor cloth, was all free. You can do a lot with a good chain of friends. As long as you take care of them, they'll take care of you. Hey, cheeky, cheeky. Voice is pretty. All gray. Beautiful colors. Well, let's take a walk down to the big, the big chickies. All this scrap wood, even that OSB, all those cedar slabs. The sawhorse I built out of scrap. But all this wood here, you can find this stuff free anywhere. Let's go over and check out Rudy. This is the coop that I built last year. I just got to put siding on it. Hey, Rudy! Hey, Rudy! That's Rudy right there. That's the Americana Longhorn. 
he's the one that's getting them, uh, you know, fertilized. And over here is Buddy. Those two right, nope, not just that one. <laughs> and that one walking away. That was Rudy's fertilization to the Isa Browns. And that rooster, oh, he's, he's a year old. But Rudy doesn't bother him. Buddy doesn't bother Rudy. So life is good in the coop. We're going to build another one of these coops over to the side here. So that I can uh, keep track of the older chickens versus the younger ones. There's 80. She's going to come get you. Hey, you know you're not allowed to. But... That girl's standing her ground, Sadie. All right, Sadie. Sadie. Hey. Say, and now scared them all out. I got 13 here, 11 laying hens, and I get nine eggs a day. I think some of my browns are a little too old, or they're just uh, they don't want to work anymore. I just can't figure out which ones they are. Because if I did, I'd be putting them in my freezer. Hey, Rudy. Hey, big Rudy. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Rudy. So things are going good on the homestead. Nothing's really gotten in here lately. I had to take out a skunk the other day because she was trying to get in and get the eggs. So my chicken coop kind of stinks for a couple weeks now. <laughs> right, Rudy? He must be four years old now. Such a beautiful rooster. We get along really good. He won't let you touch him. Yeah, Rudy. Sadie. Sadie, that that rooster would tear you up. Come on, Rudy. Sadie, that's enough, girl. All right, Sadie only does this when I'm down by the coop. She'll run around the coop. <laughs> that metal on the other side is actually from a, a a tin shed that I got for free. I use it as a fencing. Oh, so you're gonna go down and check out the back property. We call that rooster Buddy. Hey, Buddy! Hey, Buddy, Buddy! Noah's the one that named him. And I've seen him mating with the other chickens, fertilizing them. So I'm not sure what my next batch is going to look like. It's going to either be Rudy or Buddy's. We can take a walk on the inside. Yeah, okay. Sadie, no, you're not allowed in there. Oh, somebody's in the roost. Hey, girl. Sadie, get. Hey, girls. Oh, no, 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 no. You're fine. You're fine, girl. This is one of the black sex links. Yes, yeah, she's a good girl. She's a good girl. Let's see if she's got an egg under there. Oh, it's nice and warm. No egg. Okay, girl. You're good to go. You stay right there. 
you scary Marshall. <laughs> My chickens are so calm. <laughs> Let's see, you guys got some water. You guys got food. Everything looks good, girls. Rudy, everything is good, buddy. They have these four foot <laughs> picture windows. This is like a little uh, chateau for the chicken. Right, girl, girl. Here comes a Rudy. Yeah, hey, Rudy. What are you doing, buddy? Yeah, you want to say hi to everybody, Rudy? Oh, he's going to show everybody his tail feathers. So life is good here on the homestead. Oh. Now my dog seems to like to eat the hay that they poop on. The chickens poop on. And then she'll either poop it out, and only half it comes out, and then she runs around trying to get it out. I can't stop her from doing it. I've tried. Right, Rudy Doo Doo. Right, Rudy Buddy. You want to say hello, Rudy? He takes good care of them girls. All right, I'll leave you guys alone. And hey, if you want to lay an egg for me, that'd be gravy. Okay, babe? All right. Okay. All right. So, that's my chicken coop. And, well, whatever else I've been showing you. But, uh, I'm going to have to go in the house now. And Meemaw got me some cooking. Well, it's my wife, but Noah calls... My wife, Mima, which is cute. She calls him Moon Pie, just like on the Goldbirds. It's kind of cute. But anyway, uh, ooh. there we go. I'll talk at all you soon.